a police. Hush Poppy and Mr. Woodbury have been extradited to the United States of America after their arrest in Dubai, United Arab Emirates. The disclosure was made in a statement by the Dubai police on Thursday in which the United States Federal Bureau of Investigations extended its gratitude to the United Arab Emirate Crime Watchdog for its role in apprehending and extraditing the two most wanted suspects in the United Arab Emirates. Hush Poppy and Mr. Woodbury and 10 others were arrested in an operation tagged Fox Hunt after they were accused of committing crimes outside the United Arab Emirates, including money laundering, cyber fraud, hacking, criminal impersonating, scamming individuals, banking fraud and identity theft. The Dubai police accused them of this. The director of Dubai CIA Brigadier Alaf Aja said that the raid that led to the arrest of Hush Puppy and Mr. Woodbury resulted in the confiscation of incriminating documents of a planned fraud on a global scale worth more than 355 million US dollars. The team also seized more than 40 million dollars in cash, 13 luxury cars with an estimated value of 6.8 million dollars obtained from fraud crimes and confiscated 21 computer devices, 47 smartphones, 15 memory cards, 5 hard disks containing 119,000 fraud files, as well as address of more than 1.9 million victims, the Dubai police said. Just recently, the Dubai police and the Federal Bureau of Investigations, FBI, has arrested two most wanted fraudsters in the world, which are Hush Puppy and Mr. Woodbury, along with 10 other African cyber criminals in a special operation. The operation took down the suspects for committing crimes outside the United Arab Emirates, including money laundering, cyber fraud, hacking, criminal impersonating, scamming individuals, banking fraud, and identity theft. The suspects were caught in a series of synchronized raids by six SWAT teams from Dubai police who fought the gang's bid to deceive many people around the world and steal their money. The Dubai police and the CIA said that the raid resulted in confiscating incriminating devices of which Hush Puppy and Mr. Woodbury were caught with. So the team also seized more than 150 million United Arab Emirates dollars in cash and 13 luxury cars which an estimated value of more than 25 million US dollars obtained from fraud crimes and confiscated 21 computer devices, 47 smartphones, 15 memory card sticks, 5 hard disks containing 119 fraud files as well as addresses of more than 1.9 million victims, the Dubai police said. After conducting further investigation and analysis, the Dubai police investigators uncover sensitive information by the suspect. The suspect and 10 others were tracked down and arrested by Dubai police in a operation Fox Hunt 2. According to a short documentary detailing the process of their arrest, the Dubai police and the FBI monitored and tracked the suspect frosters and associates for four months. It was also revealed that they have defrauded almost 2 million victims globally of 168 billion naira seizing more than 50 billion in cash and 13 luxury cars worth 3.7 billion naira a lot of nigerians has taken to their social media to react on the arrest of mr woodbury and hush puppy so this one says let's see the outcome the united states just need hush puppy and mr woodbury to tighten their system you think us are stupid like nigerians government that will prosecute frosters don't be surprised if Hush Puppy and Mr. Woodbury worked with the U.S. Artificial Intelligence AI. Hush Puppy and Mr. Woodbury will help them with a lot of things and they need my elder sister, the one I was immediately born after, had to die of just typhoid in Nigeria in Gagada General Hospital. Why did my sister have to die? Because my parents didn't have enough money. Why did she have to die? Because they didn't attend to her quick in the hospital. You have to answer these questions that give me pains that I go through 
all the time, every day in my life. You have to under, you have to be able to tell me why my parents have to suffer so much, and they can't be proud of one thousand naira. So much, and they can't be proud of one thousand naira that has been given to them by the federal government. My mother is from the Niger the other part of Nigeria where Nigeria's oil come from. She has never benefited. My mother is from the Niger Delta. She has never benefited one dollar from the Niger Delta, the oil producing part of Nigeria where she comes from. One dollar and she's over sixty years old. In my whole generation, my papa papa, my papa, my papa papa papa, my papa now only me see escape poverty small only me for our whole generation when i won't come clamp that same me say no i suppose suffer only that me where okay where they chop no sweats when i look i no deserve no sweats as my papa they also reach my papa also pass buhari i suffer so much and you know enjoy my enjoyment from the government see today what single, single enjoyment my papa know they enjoy? Why the guys explain to my papa why my papa guys got using and bury your own picking, bury your own second wife? We die, they die, they, my sister die, he died to away. If not today, you nothing say that thing do my sister, I think nothing say go die. When mommy don't be now, nothing say go die. Um, you know how many families they go through so many things like that? Do you know how many families? Are suffering different kind of pain within their hearts because of negligence of the government because the government don't cater for them if they talk they go say nigeria don't they look the people for lucky they don't they do this they don't they pass the gates and i'm going to use stupid stupid things they qualify nigeria say don't they look at no deserve no sweat as my papa they also reach my papa also pass buhari my papa also passed of us on job in children, all in children. Now even only me, now in get, and I look say only that me I suppose suffer, I no deserve enjoyment. Then if Buhari children, no, they no deserve enjoyment, riches. I swear, Buhari children, they no deserve enjoyment, riches because if they look out person, they also reach. My papa also passed Buhari. My mama suffer past Buhari wife. We 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 be in children, we suppose they fly private jets. But we don't fly private jet. I suffer. How can I don't jam me? So many times. No, we don't jam me. For the same Nigeria, I don't nearly die. I can't escape. I can't escape on our country. Just few years now, yeah, I don't they enjoy. This enjoyment never even match up. Just this small enjoyment where they enjoy. He never, he never did equilibrium to the, to the stuff how they enjoy. He never, he never did equilibrium to the, to the stuff where I don't suffer. I don't suffer for decades. I never enjoy reach, you reach five years safe. So now they look say no, they're supposed to bring me back to come suffer. Say this no now must I must suffer. I then you do yeah for what be a sign. What no fight you guys understand say this thing where you want start. You don't know where you go little from now. From now, the Jaden Yoju, we the people of Nigeria, we the masses, we demand to make you stop to the fight for us because you are clearly not fighting for us. If you want debates, you need to arrange debates between my papa and Buari. May they sit down, may they talk, may Buari need to explain to my papa where my papa got suffered so much. And you know, I enjoy one enjoyment. But what of people in Badagri, people in Agege, people in Epa? Enjoyment free your side. What about people where they are going in state? Not for once I don't watch news. I don't hear say one development reach a boy. Nasa Arawa, all those kind of places. They're not be Nigerians. They're not be deserve enjoyment. Um na hunt sit down. Look say uh meet where they chop for abroad. Na in the affect Nigeria. Na in make Nigeria no good. I don't deserve to chop meat. I don't deserve to wear the tackle. I don't deserve to look like human being. You can't look finish. You say make me and you do debate. And I don't accept. I don't accept. First, you gotta pay me the charges for me to come. You guys do everything because 
I be social media influencer that they pay me. If you want to go look YouTube, go look countries where they don't pay me to come to come to come host parties, events. You say you don't know my sort of income. I got to paste your face first now. But yes, I don't accept. And inside the rules of the debate, now you guys fight. The guys leave us more we'll fight one on one. Now you guys beat ourselves. The guys give us chance. Maybe and you. Don't be laughing my mouth with this one. I'm serious. I'm serious. All the suffer with my mama don't suffer everything. I just put up for this guy. But me, I don't stress. Me, I cut down. They let me touch the guy small, so you understand. You go, oh no, you go, no. Oh, go on, give you first, me. Why you they laugh? Like, I they talk the same way they pay me, you they laugh. Now, I suppose this is my story. Do documentary. So give people hope. And I look, say, no. People not supposed to get hope. People not deserve hope. People who not suffer them as they used to. I then you give and others. I lose and I wait and I deserve so far. Yeah, yeah, you understand. I have that that respect for MI, you know. This trade him unplug of seven years ago when the MI closed or something. I swear to God, if you permit me, I'll bring you a picture from it where I was there. I can remember how I was on top of my voice when MI was performing. Every, I, I admire him so much, you understand? These are like, if they are talking about rap, these are people that I can drop their names. That, oh, these are great rappers in Nigeria, you understand? So I don't expect him to be looking for such a cheap attention to sell his music, you know? We, we, he's supposed to be in a position of respect today. Tomorrow, you understand? Uh, Where we, even if we come back home, uh, we have to see him somewhere. We're like, I am Baba in Hong Kong. You understand? It's not you that is not supposed to uh, ask for pay money. It's not his clinical money. Did your mama money loss? Before you are saying one person show more money, you, your papa money loss. Can you show us any documents that your own money lost? That you are looking for and you feel it is all it is the hush puppy's pocket. You even have enough money to be in hush puppy's pocket. You understand? So if you need help, if you need attention, message me, DM me, let me help you and promote your music. If you hate me for that song, you go go out to make you abuse me. Now nobody cares for you. You understand? If you help me, you go go far. I will help you promote that. They ah, they owe me. I swear to God, I swear to God, the biggest day in my life, one of the biggest days in my life that, that I recognize my journey, my success, how far I have come was the day that I was in a club and two faces came to meet me. I'm like, ah, now you be that guy with the disturb internet. I'm like, more two faces money. You understand? It's still in my head till today. It's still in my head till today. With two faces, only they want that me Two face, oh dad call me, oh mommy, ah, oh I'm not even here. Oh dad, I'm not even here. You know I'm not going to say. You understand? Anyway, I see that bros. I ready to portrait. Say, ah, Baba, I go die there. The person disrespect two face for my funds. You understand? So you you cannot come and now use any cheap. If I see him any day now, you either make everybody go their own way or make a tear in the chest. Related to you, I'm not fucking your girlfriend. I'm not doing anything. I don't even. I'm not even living in the same environment with you. I'm not affecting your life or your music in any way. You understand? I'm sleeping my own jaja. You will come and sleep for us. For us. For me. You know, big dog. Who is big dog? What? Ah. Who am I? Who do ah? Why is Adi Jimero from the same town? Big dog. Nibu. You understand? <laughs> thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very much. 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 I love the way you responded in your own street way to that. You are literally telling us now that he did it for attention. He was seeking promotion for his album and he could have done it in a more respectful manner. That is. That is why I replied him. That is why I replied him. 
that is why I replied to you. Especially for someone who is 